Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. Well, there is no denying this man's striking credentials. Prevailing wisdom is he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. He has to. You know, this is what got him to the show. It was being able to use the hands to set up the kicks. We all talk about the high-level boxing background of this young man. But as he's developed, he's developed great knees. Yeah. He's developed great timing, great counter skills, and also the beautiful right high kick. The right high kick is something he hides very well as he follows with a jab right hand, left hook. High kick comes over the top, and he can put you to sleep. No doubt about it, he'll try to put on a striking clinic once again here tonight. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make him yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Both fighters are 31, with big differences in height, but some differences in reach. All right, here now, the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon is Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC Heavyweight Division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet two inches tall, weighing in at 240 pounds. Fighting out of Irvine, California, Assassin. And now introducing his opponent, fighting at the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. They touch him up, and we are underway. Ready. You ready to fight? All right, let's get this one started here. Round one is underway. And we've got a strike. He is the first one to reckon with tonight, though. He draws a guy who can do a little bit of everything. And that guy is usually the one that will have the advantage. But we know what a high-level striker is. And this guy is as high-level as we've ever seen in the UFC. Oh, really exploiting his reach advantage as he landed the jab there, DC. Look at the force behind that leg kick. to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this jump. Oh, big one slam. The left punch is true, now the right hand. Oh, no way, spinning back fist. And then take shot, now, take shot. Oh, the bottom with a head kick, that at least partially landed. Oh my goodness, that kicks in 
the head as he's still standing. Three minutes and counting to go here in round one. Look at him working and trying to shut the liver down. Speed at which he throws is crazy. Straight right, he misses. Single follow tie now. Chill, nice body kick. Land. Hard shots landed. Yeah, looks a little wobbly on his feet. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, straight right. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body. Just out of range with that right hook. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh! Back to the feet. Knee to the body. So a strong five minutes down. So the crowd voicing its appreciation after that round. We had a knockdown courtesy of a punch midway through. DC, here's your highlight. It was straight. He threw him in combination and landed that big punch that really did hurt his opponent. Lesser men would have been done. He's got a tough guy in front of him. He will have to go back to this again. He will have to get back to this action if he wants to get the desired finish. Landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no. no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the <laughs> whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Oh, nice job to land the straight punch there. Must be nice to have that kind of reach advantage, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, beautiful head movement. Slips there. Nice straight punch. Ooh, head kick lands, and he's hurt. And he landed the right hand there. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Nice one-two there. Can't take many of those, you better check. Oh, setting up the left hook, but out of range. Oh, nice jab there. He told us on Thursday he wanted to break this dude's nose. That Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Just misses there with the left. Looked like it did stun him a little bit. Dude's hurt. 
Serve him up. Go get him. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Just like that, the fight is over. Holy smokes! Beautiful shot to end the fight right there. It couldn't have landed much more flush than it did, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, quite frankly. So, near perfect execution on the strike that ultimately results in the KO here tonight. All right, DC, no Telestrator tonight, but we're gonna get you some highlights from this one. This was a fight that had it all, and for my money, his best performance to date. His best performance to date in the biggest moment. In the biggest moments, you gotta show up. And that's exactly what he did tonight. He used every bit of his skill to get the job done. Here once more, Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called stop to this contest at four minutes, 17 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Assassin. Now, there will be no shutting that smile off tonight. The celebration is on as he gets a huge win by knockout tonight. I gotta think there are a few better feelings in the world. Thank you for watching. Please wait for more videos. See you soon. Yeah, you shut a person's lights off, man.